And while we're on the topic of top rope dives, for the love of Christ, if you're in an eight-man tag match, let's say six of them are on the outside, and one of the guys on the inside wants to do a dive to the outside. So what does, what does that mean? That means the six guys on the outside have to awkwardly, slowly, and clumsily gather together, like very softly, weirdly punch each other, but also be looking to the to the ring to see when, when the guy's gonna jump on you. Everyone gets together, starts hugging each other, even though you're fighting each other. And then the guy in the ring then jumps off the top rope, lands on them, and then everybody catches them. Every week I see this. It, first of all, it's no longer special. If you see a tope over the top rope every match, it's not special when you see it. People don't give a shit about it. It dilutes the appeal of it. But then you add in this extra shitty aspect of people just gathering around to catch the guy. It looks dumb. Like I said, it takes me out of it. Anything that takes me out of the match, objectively, is a shit thing to do. Because no longer am I watching, you know, two or four or however many guys. No longer am I watching people compete against each other. Now, it's a choreographed cooperation. Now, I'm just watching dancing. And that, and personally, there are people that like dancing. I don't like dancing. I want wrestling. And when fucking Phoenix or whoever jumps onto 12 guys that are all huddled together to catch them, who, who is that for? It's not impressive by any stretch. It looks dumb, and nobody benefits from it. And everybody that stands around to catch them looks like an idiot. God, can we get past that? Can we stop doing that?